Garden magazine. We gotta get far right there. Is that Tracy Lawrence? Yes, it is. enjoy this week's video. Bye guys! What's up? What's up? I found something exciting. Oh yeah? Gotta see it. This is awesome. It is. Well, I'm gonna be here a while. <laughs> Damn. The only downside, though, is I can't look anything up. <laughs> Trying to check the angle. Right. Two resale shops now. Or warehouse sales. Oh, I seen it before you did. Nuh-uh. Yeah. Are we getting it? I don't know. I'm terrible at recording. That's why I let you do it. It's from... I don't know. 2002. It feels like the batteries are corroded if there's some in here. You hear me? Yeah. Doesn't it look like it's corroded? Holy. And the buttons don't work, like as in the, like, it's corroded all the way on the inside, like oh. it was wet. Bummer. We found this cool thing. We already have one, but do what? You found a whole sixty-four. What? And this is in the other stuff but, that you. But, uh, uh, that's actually been here for a while because that came from Tyler. Really? Yeah, and I just you just it. never never saw it. Hey, well, that's sixty bucks right there. Yeah. Just for the, the if it looks like that, that's it. like what I usually do if I find one that has the expansion pack is I'll take this out, sell this separately, and then either sell this by itself or just these are like five bucks at Game Exchange for the regular one and stick it in there and sell it that way. But yeah, that's like sixty bucks for just that. Damn. Yeah. That's the first thing I do when I find one is always look in there. That's crazy. So you've had that for a long time? <laughs> that just makes you wonder what else. Well, I mean, it's like that, that gold nugget ring that I found, that, that senior found in that safe. Mm -hmm. I've had that safe for... The group where I bought it was the group that I started the store with. Dang. So it's been... I've had it that long. It just lets you think of like what may have slipped through the cracks, you know, mm -hmm. like the warehouse sale. Some dude like, how much for this box of stuff, you know? And it's got a diamond ring in the bottom. Okay. Yeah. That, and then thirty. Thirty. You sure? Yeah. There's a twenty. I shouldn't have paid for our lunch with cash. I always do that. I don't know why. And then I have less cash. 30. Sweet. Now you can say you made 30 more dollars than before. <laughs> this does look just like our kitchen, doesn't I know, it? That's why I said oh, so you weird. put letters on this. Yeah. And we can throw the other one straight in the trash. Oh, we got that for our wedding. Sorry. How you doing? Alright. Cheeto puffs. <laughs> 
Good morning. <laughs> Do you know what that is? Yeah, it's mean like a hippie. Yeah, kind of like that. Hey, I was right. You were? I was right. I don't know which one it is. Oh, it's the the one I have right now. Look at this squishmallow. You think we should get this, babe? What is it? A squishmallow. Yeah, I'm trying to figure it out. How much is this? Five. This is like a hot wheel racetrack. Isn't this? Oh my god. Yeah. It's chilly. Feels good to me. Um. No, I think this is it. Is right. that okay? Yeah, I'll get it. It's a big one. Yeah. We'll just get there. I don't know who, who Me! <laughs> <laughs> Take all the money! <laughs> Thank y'all. It's huge. It is huge. There you go! Thank you. Thank, Thank you all. Good day. You too. too. A lot of nice decor. Oh, I guess they're going to get that couch. It was nice to be Yeah. Oh, look. <laughs> it's three dollars. Do you think we should get it? Um, it's up to you. I mean, yeah. <coughs> Is this not? No. no. Well. We'll just get this. Okay. Uh oh. Hold on. I have some. I have some dollar coins. <laughs> Are you going to show Ellis? Are you going to show Ellis Pablo? Hey, I'm kind of wondering where they're going. Oh, look. What are they? Christmas? I guess. Well, I guess you can make these by yourself, you know? Yeah. There's, there's three dollars. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Thank y'all. Have a good day. You too. Hello. Hmm? How was a long walk? Really? Yeah. Got anything cool? I don't know. Still looking. Mario and Sonic. I guess we're up. I don't know. Three of them, six o'clock. Then, not playing basketball. Maybe, uh, we're going to have some scissors. I'll push it and turn off that chair. I'm going to get good things with it. What about the games? Mm -hmm. Would y'all take 20 for this? Yes. I have a Wii console, I just don't have the power cable. Well, so. my console switched out on me. <laughs> yeah, I have the console, I just don't have the rest. So, thank you very much. Thank you. Have a great weekend. You too. You too. What's up, guys? Before I show you what we picked up over the weekend, which really wasn't anything super crazy, uh, 
Actually, we really didn't get anything on video, I don't think. But I did pick up some pretty cool stuff that day. Uh, I messaged somebody about games uh, that was having a yard sale <clears throat> closer to us than where we went. He set them aside, uh, picked them up. But this is way better than that. So I make a post every so often on Facebook looking to buy games. And uh, I made the post, I don't know, in about 20 groups or so, local selling pages. And a guy hit me up, said he had some old Nintendo stuff. So I was like, okay, you know, people would say that all the time. They got the NES with like six games, of course, Duck Hunt. Um, he sent some pictures of just a, a tote. And I could see like two of these magazines in there. And you could see there was quite a few. I think there's 33 games total, um, 22 magazines. And I asked him if he could spread out the magazines, you know. So I started looking. Um, average selling price for this one, since it's the number two issue, uh, this one's complete with the poster and the calendar. Uh, one sold for, I think, $275, but some of them go for like $140, $160, uh, some as low as $99, but that one's in amazing condition. The, most of these are like, let's see, most of these are like immaculate. I mean, the spines, they've been like in this tote, I guess, since 1989, but anyways, um, <clears throat> he asked if I was going to resell. I told him, yes, I will resell most of it, but I do keep some for my personal collection. So he looked up some of the stuff. Let me get a shot of the games. He looked up some of the stuff, and uh, he, excuse my foot there, he asked if 250 was fair. So, of course, I looked up a few of the magazines, a few of the games, and I said, yeah, 250 is fair. So the next day, uh, I sold locally uh ds a ps2 and a ps3 for i think 235 and then i went straight and picked this up afterward it's about a 25 minute drive to pick this up but um the magazines in the condition they're in uh i comped them i always do average i don't ever do the highest price i don't ever look at the lowest price um it was like 760 i want to say for all of these i think there's 22 or 23 so 760 in profit here. Well, not profit, but 500 in profit. That's before fees. Most of the games aren't worth more than 10 or 15 bucks, but with the manuals, it's going to increase the value a little bit. Plus, uh, when I was digging this out, there were two Zelda manuals, which I thought was funny. And then I happened to find another copy of Zelda in one of the consoles. So got to test the consoles here in a minute. He said they both work. They look super clean. I mean, all this stuff is pretty clean uh, compared to some of the stuff I bought. But going to start testing that. Uh, before these tornadoes come and start getting it listed so what's up guys hope you enjoyed the video sales weren't crazy for the second weekend in a row uh, i guess it's still kind of early it's still you know early april uh probably looks like a mess back here oh well uh so i think we're gonna go next friday because i'm off work and then we have a guy coming to do some mulching at our house uh saturday so we won't go saturday but looking forward to that we actually did get some pretty good stuff um literally um all gaming stuff besides two things but anyways i'm gonna go over everything real quick talk about where we got it how much we spent what we're willing or what we're gonna try to sell it for how we'll sell it and things like that so so first up we picked up uh actually in the morning there was a local yard sale um i asked about games on facebook <clears throat> the guy sent me a picture of these two ps3s this ps3 this genesis uh this ps2 this whole stack of games uh these two games and these two controllers and there's also all the cables and um one more uh controller for the genesis so far this works this works and one of these works i haven't tested the other one yet um paid 150 for all that which i'm happy with uh i'm gonna try to sell all the playstations locally i'll probably sell this one online um for some reason people around here well, most people, they do not buy the retro stuff. We'll post it local for, you know, decent price and, you know, you never get any hits on it. Um, a sale at a gym we went to found this Switch dock. Have not tested it yet, but I'm going to test it with my Switch. Hopefully it works. Uh, and this PS4 controller. Uh, we asked how much it was. They said a dollar each. Uh, it was like a multi-family sale and the people who actually had this, I guess they just weren't there so they said a dollar each so even if it doesn't work i mean for a dollar it's pretty cool and then of course we went to uh blake had a sale at a different warehouse than you guys you guys have seen in the videos before 
Um, and for 30 bucks, got Diddy Kong. It's authentic. Mario Kart, authentic. Um, two little Mario figures and Jesus. And then this wooden angel. Um, these two games are personal. Allie actually started her a collection. She has a few um, cases, like DS cases, um, 3DS case, a couple Game Boy games. So this is actually like her first home console game. Pretty cool. Uh, this is for my personal collection. It's one I've wanted for a little bit. And then we're going to go half and half on this 64 console with an expansion pack. Uh, I'll probably split these up. Get about 50 or 60 for the expansion pack and then ask, I don't know, 75 for the console with no controller. Um, but anyways, other than that, uh, it was a pretty awesome weekend. Looking forward to next weekend.